be inviting Princey Sekia from Meghalaya. Please welcome her. Good afternoon. Listen to the perennial rivers, to the folklore, to the echoes of the immortal mountains. Ladies and gentlemen, listen, listen to India. From Ashoka to Akbar, they all rule this land as one single entity. After independence, India maintained this geographic entity. Article 1 of our Indian constitution states that Bharat shall be a union of states. There goes the popular saying from Kashmir to Kanyakumari, India is one. Culture-wise, India is a melting pot of diverse religion, race, language, ethnicity. But India believes in Sarva Dharma Sambhava, which means respect and tolerance to all belief system. Easternmost Manipuris, they dance for the same Radha Krishna, just like the Gujaratis in the westernmost end. Northern Kashmiris in Amarnath worship Shem Shiva, like the Tamils in southernmost Rameshwaram. We hear people talk of Mahabharata characters, whether in village of Assam and in Andhra. Culture binds these differences together. Now, talking of India's economy, ladies and gentlemen, we all know the economic view of India, the general view. But I want to draw your attention towards the present scenario, and that is transforming India 2022. Our Honorable Prime Minister, Sri Narendra Modi ji, has launched the Sankalp Se Siddhi schemes, which aims at minimum government, maximum governance. And when I meant that, which means the youth. And talking of that, the government has launched flagship schemes like Digital India, that provides e-governance to all citizens to bridge the gap between rural and urban India through high-speed internet connectivity. Make in India to popularize Indian manufacturing units, beach the bazaar tak to double farmers' income, and to bring reforms to Indian agricultural sector, which is the backbone of India's economy. Ladies and gentlemen, sabka saath, sabka vikas is only possible when you and I, we stand together, we act together. And because we are the warrior of nation building, and in the words of our prime minister, who have said that the way people engage themselves, devoted themselves to quit India movement, in the same way we all must take the pledge to make a new India, a India that is free of poverty, corruption, casteism, communalism, a India that is clean and more technologically, technologically advanced. And with that, this is Prince Saika speaking on Connecting India. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.